For two years, Mahmoud Hussein has been locked inside an Egyptian prison. His right to trial denied. His legal rights rejected. The Al Jazeera journalist flew to Cairo in 2016 to visit his family. After he landed, he was questioned and detained. He's been in solitary confinement ever since, without being formally charged. He suffered a broken arm and was refused proper medical treatment. Egyptian prosecutors accused the Qatar-based journalist of broadcasting what it describes as false news and of receiving foreign funds to defame state institutions. He strongly denies the allegations, and so does Al Jazeera. Echoing international outrage, the U.N. has been calling for his release. Rights groups have reported an unparalleled crackdown on Egyptian journalists since the military deposed the first democratically elected president, Mohamed Morsi, in 2013. The suppression has increased under former general, now president, Abdel Fattah al-Sisi. The Committee to Protect Journalists says at least 20 media workers are being held in Egyptian prisons. Hussein's detention has breached Egypt's own penal code, since he's been held without trial for more than 18 months, the maximum period allowed for anyone being investigated for a crime. He should have either been released or taken to court. Neither has happened. Two years in, his family and others are left waiting for justice. Katia Lopez-Sodoyan, Al Jazeera.